My name is Rosemary Wells, and today I'm going to read you a story. Max and Ruby and Twin Trouble by Rosemary Wells. Max's sister Ruby knew all about new babies. Mama and Papa were going to have one. You can see for yourself, Max, said Ruby. There's a new baby in there. But Max knew Mama had eaten too many cookies. He showed Ruby the cookie jar. It was empty. See, Max said to Ruby. Ruby explained to Max all about where babies came from. But Max didn't believe Ruby. He knew where babies came from. Taxis. Cousin Martha came home in a taxi. So did Aunt Ida's baby. Ruby brought out her Hannah the Howler doll. I helped Mama when you were a new baby, said Ruby, so I know everything you have to do. Max knew he was never, ever a new baby. Hannah's hungry, said Ruby. She pushed Hannah's button. Hannah had a big voice. Ruby filled Hannah's bottle with water. Watch, Max. This is how you feed a baby, said Ruby. Hannah drank the whole bottle. It went right through her. Ruby pushed the button. Hannah howled again. Hannah needs a bath and a change, Max, said Ruby. Here's how you bathe the baby, Max. In she goes. Then you dry the baby off. On goes her nappy, then her nighty. Then you put her to bed, see? Hannah closed her eyes and went to sleep. Babies are a lot of work, Max. Max could certainly see that. He pushed Hannah's button. You woke her up, Max, said Ruby. All done, said Max. Suddenly, it was time for the real new baby to pop out into the world. It's going to be a girl, I just know it, said Ruby. Grandma came to babysit. Grandma brought magic cards for Ruby. She brought a space helmet for Max. The next morning, Max watched out the window. Taxi, Max shouted, taxi. Oh my goodness, said Grandma. Double wow, said Ruby. There were two. Who knew? Oliver was certainly not a girl. At least Grace is a girl, said Ruby. Into the house, the new family came. Oliver ate and had his bath and got changed and went to sleep and woke up and ate again and had his bath again and went to sleep again. Then Grace woke up and had her bath and her breakfast and her change and went to sleep and then Oliver woke up. Oliver had lunch. At nap time, Grace woke up. Day and night, everyone worked. Max wound up Oliver's and Grace's viber chairs. Oliver grew bigger. Grace began to sit up. But one day, Oliver and Grace both felt very peaky. Nothing in the whole world made them happy. Mama gave them gripe water. Papa gave them a dab of vanilla ice cream. Grandma brought new toys. Daddy changed Oliver. Nothing worked. Max wound up the vibra chairs for them. Everyone sang to them, but no one could make Oliver happy. Grace couldn't sleep. No one could sleep. Then Max had an idea. He went into the toy box. He pulled Hannah out from under a pile of dolls. He sat Hannah up in Oliver and Grace's crib and pushed her button. Hannah began to howl. Oliver's little eyes lit up. Grace started laughing. Soon Oliver, Grace, and Hannah fell asleep in a heap. All done, said Max.